a new seat in City Hall. The pastor, businessman, and council member could soon add the title of president before his name. He welcomed news for his Rich Newberg into his home this Christmas, where he's most comfortable just being grandpa. Strike up the band. It's Christmas Day in the Pridgen household. Reverend Darius Pridgen lighting the fireplace and making spirits bright for his family. He has five children and eight grandchildren. <laughs> but I enjoy it. I enjoy seeing them playing. I enjoy seeing them laughing. The Reverend says family always comes first. But this Christmas, he also has something special to look forward to eight days from now, when he is expected to be chosen by his fellow Buffalo lawmakers to become president of the Common Council. This will be, uh, if everything holds uh, firm, the first time that the Common Council has unanimously voted on one candidate since they have been internally voting. Preacher and lawmaker, charismatic and always energized, Reverend Pridgen says he will remain an independent thinker as Common Council president, even if it means at times not seeing eye to eye with the mayor. I believe in cooperation if it's the right thing to do. If our mayor is going in a direction that we as a common council, as individual common council members agree upon, then we should support. But if we don't agree, people do not elect us to be rubber stamps. I woke up in love this morning. But this day is intended to be more about love and faith than politics, and also about hope. But I want the legacy that I leave for my children is that I was a peacemaker uh, and that I tried hard to bring peace to our people. The Buffalo Common Council has its reorganizational meeting on January 2nd. Rich Newberg, News 4 at 11.